Would you like to win an international trip? You could win a seven-day trip to Italy. Would you like to win a car? You could win a 2021 Ford Mustang designed by NASCAR driver Kevin Harvick. Keep on listening to find out how you can enter for your chance to win. Do you love winning? Do you love winning prizes for free? Well, we do too. Welcome to the Sweeping Up Sweepstakes podcast and YouTube channel, where we talk all about sweepstakes, contests, and giveaways. Oh my! Find out tips and tricks to enter smarter and increase your chances of winning. Now, here is your host that likes to boast from coast to coast about the most prizes he has won, Billy J. Hey everybody, and welcome to the seventh episode of Sweeping Up Sweepstakes, a podcast and YouTube channel all about sweepstakes, contests, and giveaways. As my announcer Nicole said, I am your host, Billy J. I've won numerous prizes, including trips, computers, gift cards, and so much more over the last 20 plus years. On today's episode, we'll first talk about an upcoming appearance on With the Contest Queen on this upcoming Thursday, April 8th, 2021. Then, I would like to talk about yet another grand prize trip that I have won in the past. Give you a tip or trick to help you enter sweepstakes, contests, and giveaways smarter, and increase your chances of winning. And then, we will finally talk about a couple of sweepstakes that you may want to enter before they end. Also, stay tuned at the end of this episode as I talk about the exciting giveaway that we started. You could win a $25 Amazon E gift card. Let's first talk about an upcoming appearance on with the Contest Queen, which will take place on Thursday, April 8th, 2021 at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time or 7 p.m. Central Standard Time on the Contest Queen's Facebook page and on YouTube. The links to the Contest Queen's Facebook page and YouTube channel can be found in the description of this YouTube episode on YouTube or in the episode notes of the podcast that you are listening to. Can't make it to the live show? That's okay. The video will still be available on her Facebook page and YouTube channel. We will be talking all about sweepstakes, contests, and giveaways. I'm sure we'll talk about this podcast, YouTube channel, and some of my background. Be sure to check it out as I talk of royalty herself, the Contest Queen. On the next segment, let's talk about yet another grand prize trip that I have won in the past. As I talked in the last six episodes, I have won a trip to Las Vegas, two trips to New York City, a trip to Orlando, Florida, and a trip to Puerto Rico, and a trip to Beverly Hills, California. Well, would you know it, I won another trip. This time, the trip was to Providence, Warwick, Rhode Island. Back in May 2018, my local radio station, which is literally about one mile from my house, was participating in a national giveaway called A Weekend in New England. The radio station was selected out of all the radio stations in the country participating. Then, the radio station selected one winner to win, and that was me. You can enter the giveaway on the radio station's website daily. I only had entered it twice, as I found out about it as it was about to end. With just those two entries, I still won the grand prize in the Weekend in New England giveaway, which featured a performance from a British singer and songwriter, Colum Scott. I received round-trip airfare starting on Friday, June 1st, and returned Sunday, June 3rd, to Providence T.F. Green International Airport. Compliments of Capitol Records. Also, two nights at the Crown Plaza Warwick in Warwick, Rhode Island. $50 gift card to Blue on the Water Restaurant, courtesy of Cumulus Media. A gondola ride for two. Two tickets to the Second Chance Prom Formal Affair. And a private meet and greet with photos with Colum Scott. 
My friend and I had a great time, except we had some problems at the airport on the way there. The airline had overfueled the plane, which caused a delay. We had to get off the plane, and then they asked for 12 volunteers to take a later flight that day, so that they could make up for the abundance of fuel. Since we were going to miss our connection in Washington, D.C. anyways by this time, we volunteered and took a later flight. The later flight took us to Charlotte first, then to Rhode Island. We finally got to Rhode Island around midnight, which was about eight hours later than originally planned. Unfortunately, we missed out on the gondola ride and didn't get a chance to go to Blue on the Water restaurant. We had a nice time at the Second Chance Prom that featured a performance by Colm Scott. He sang a few songs, including Dancing on My Own and You Are the Reason. He's a great singer. We got the chance to meet with him and get some pictures together. He was very nice to talk to. Overall, it was a nice short weekend trip. I'd like to go back and spend more time in the area. Moving right along to the next section of our show, Let's talk about a tip and trick to help you enter sweepstakes, contests, and giveaways smarter, and to help you increase your chances of winning. This episode's tip and trick is about radio giveaways. The grand prize trip that I had won was a radio giveaway. Your odds are better at winning a local radio station giveaway, as there are less people to compete with, unless it is a national radio giveaway, in which the odds of winning are far less. Radio stations want to promote their station and keep listeners tuned in so they can get advertising money from advertisers. One way to promote their station is to do giveaways. Sometimes the prizes will be small, such as a gift certificate to a local restaurant or tickets to see a show. A lot of these smaller prizes are donated by the place of business advertising. It's a win-win for the radio stations and businesses as radio stations get more listeners by giving something away and the business that donates the prize gets their business promoted on the radio station so they can gain potential new customers. For radio giveaways, you can usually enter a few different ways. Sometimes, the radio station will want you to call in at a specific time and be a certain number of caller, like as a 7th caller or ninth caller or etc., for example. Also, sometimes the radio station will give out a keyword and you need to text in to a certain number within the hour to get yourself entered into the giveaway. A couple of my local radio stations have a giveaway that if you text the keyword given, you'll be entered to have a chance to win $1,000, or you can instantly win $100. Another way that you can enter a radio giveaway is if they want you to sign up on their website. That is how I won my weekend in New England. I signed up on my local radio station's website, just twice. Sometimes you can enter daily, or you can only enter once. Make sure to read the rules so you don't disqualify yourself. One last way to enter a radio giveaway is when the radio station is on location somewhere in your area. Businesses will work out an arrangement with a radio station to do a live broadcast from their business to attract customers there. The radio station will give away prizes there from the business or other radio station prizes. Usually, they have a raffle box there where you put your information on a piece of paper, drop it in the box, and they will pick out winners. Or, they might have a prize wheel that you spin to win a promotional prize. Make sure to check out all the radio stations in your area and see if they have any promotions or giveaways. These are some of the best places for you to increase your chances of winning by winning local where there are less people entering to win. Have you won a radio giveaway before? Let us know so that we can share your wins with others. Message us on social media, leave a comment on this YouTube video, or email us at info at soupingupsweepstakes.com or soupingupsweepstakes at gmail.com. Before moving on to the final section of our episode, I have a favor or two to ask from you. Have you liked and followed us on Facebook yet? If you haven't yet, check us out on Facebook.com slash Sweeping Up Sweepstakes. Are you listening on Apple Podcasts? If you are, we need some reviews. We would really like it if you could rate us and leave a nice five-star review. 
It helps for our podcast to grow and Apple to show it to potential new listeners. Also, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe on our YouTube videos and channel. Just search for Sweeping Up Sweepstakes. Click subscribe and click the bell notification to be notified of the next episode video. Also, if you could share the videos on your social media, that would be glorious. Now it's time to move on to some sweepstakes, contests, giveaways that you may want to enter and win. The first sweepstakes you may want to enter before it expires is a 7 day trip through Italy sweepstakes, which is sponsored by Live Sozi. The grand prize includes the following. 6 nights accommodations, arrival private transfer in Rome, daily breakfast, 24 hour ticket to the iconic double decker bus in Rome, Italy, a visit to the Colosseum in Rome, train tickets from Rome to Florence, Italy, a visit to the Leaning Tower of Pisa, tasting of local products in Florence, train tickets from Florence to Venice, Italy, 30-minute gondola ride in Venice, and $1,100 in airfare credit. The grand prize is redeemable before March 31st, 2022. This sweepstakes began on March 22nd, 2021. The sweepstakes will end on April 21st, 2021 at 11.59 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. There is a limit of one entry per person email address, not including bonus entries, which you can earn. This sweepstakes is open to anyone who is at least 18 years of age and has reached the age of majority in their jurisdiction of residence at the time of opt-in. 19 in Alabama and Nebraska, 21 in Mississippi and also lives within the continental United States and has a valid email address. Sorry, Canadians. The next giveaway you may want to enter before it expires is the Bush NASCAR Mustang Giveaway, which is sponsored by Anheuser-Busch LLC. You can win a 2021 Ford Mustang designed by Kevin Harvick. The approximate retail value is $50,000. You can enter three different ways through Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram by tagging Bush Beer and posting the hashtag Bush Car Soupstakes. The soupstakes began on January 18, 2021 and ends at 11.59.59 p.m. Eastern Time on April 25, 2021. I believe you can enter only one time. The soupstakes is open to legal residents of the 50 United States and District of Columbia who are 21 years of age or older at the time of entry. Sorry again, Canadians. You can find the links to enter these two sweepstakes in the description of this YouTube episode, on YouTube, or in the episode notes of the podcast that you are listening to. You can also check out our website, www.sweepingupsweepstakes.com, for these links and so much more. Did you know that we started a giveaway? Oh yeah! You can win a $25 Amazon e-gift card from us. Just click on the link in the description of this YouTube episode on YouTube or in the episode notes of the podcast that you are listening to. You can enter daily. The giveaway is open worldwide with some country exceptions. You have until April 23rd, 2021 at 11.59.59 p.m. Central Standard Time to enter. So, make sure to get your entries in. Good luck to you, to all that enter. Well, that about wraps up the seventh episode of Souping Up Soupstakes podcast and YouTube channel. I hope you enjoy listening and watching this episode. Thank you very much for your time. On next week's episode, we'll talk about another grand prize that I have won in the past. Give you a tip or trick to help you enter sweepstakes, contests, and giveaways smarter and increase your chances of winning. And then, we will finally talk about a couple of sweepstakes that you may want to enter before they end. Did you know that you can hear this podcast on iHeartRadio, Pandora, and on your Alexa-enabled device? Just say, Hey Alexa, play Sweeping Up Sweepstakes podcast. Alexa will start to play the latest episode, and you can also listen to previous episodes. Also, be sure to check out our new merchandise. Get shirts, 
glasses, magnets, pillows, and so much more. The links to our stores on Tee Public and Zazzle are in the episode notes or description. And finally, have you won a grand prize? An unusual prize? Or anything at all? Feel free to let us know what you have won. You can reach out to us on our social media, leave a comment on YouTube, or email us at info at soupingupsweepstakes.com or soupingupsweepstakes at gmail.com. Until next time, happy winning, everyone! That's it for this week's episode of the Sweeping Up Sweepstakes podcast and YouTube channel. Thank you so much for joining us. We would appreciate it if you would rate, review, and subscribe wherever you get your podcasts. Feel free to like and comment on our YouTube videos. You can subscribe and click the bell notification on YouTube to be notified of the next weekly episode. Engage with us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram by searching for Sweeping Up Sweepstakes. Check out www.sweepingupsweepstakes.com for more information and how to give your support. Until next time, happy winnings, everyone.